Logic is like a piece of software I program like, which has its own like digital like instruments in it already with its own preset patches. So it's got like a ultra beat um, drum machine, which is obviously for drums like, and it consists of like kick drums, snare drums, hi-hats, crashes, all the drum noises you can think of would be in there. But then it varies from like different genres of music. So it'd be like big beat drums, techno drums, hip hop drums, classical drums and stuff like that. There's also like samplers where you can like sam make your own samples like. So I could like record my vocals through Logic and then I could chuck it into the sampler and mess around with it. There's also synths, uh, synthesizers, which I mainly use for like bass lines and like rhythms. And then you can run effects into the things that make the sound, i.e. equalization and compressors and like reverbs and stuff like that, which change the effect of the sound. So if you used a reverb on like a drum, you could make it sound like it was in a massive museum hall when it echoed a thousand times, or you can make it sound like it is in space floating around. And then like a compressor is similar to EQ, but it's um, so you don't like blow your speakers or so you don't like blow people's ears and that. You like it squashes down the loud parts of the track, and it like makes it all equal. There is a few effects I like using this: the um, pitch correction tool. I always use an EQ on my vocals, and I always compress my vocals as well. It's Nicky. It's Nickstar. Music matters 100. Yeah. Say like you can't sing like, but you want to sing. You can um, play around with a pitch correction tool, which will correct the pitch of your voice so it sounds like you're singing. So if you was dragging a note, but it was off like it was in an E, it would sit it to the right note, which was a C or something like that. But it makes your voice sound really robotic like. Life is never fair when no one wants to share.